Hello, hello, how are you today? I am back here. Now I'm in um, my Ayrshire estate, the little farm that I created just for this particular series. And not too much has changed since you were here last. I'm trying to remember what I did in the last recording. But I did consolidate um, my fields here. We have at least one of these up. We have to check the first thing I'm going to do is click on this though because this you're going to want to get that if you're playing the game from now this is going to be coming up in February I believe it is and you're going to want to get this because you're getting the 500 gold plus you're getting a, a gold nugget and the gold nuggets are something that become really seriously handy in the future so just start that as soon as you can so now we need um do we need tropical fish and we need the hydrangeas okay so we've got these over here i do have um absolutely no gas at all in my tank I'm going to click on this baby, which doesn't fill it up very much at this stage, but we'll get there. And we are going to harvest our little fleurs. One each. And a bit of extra there. And unfortunately, the fish are certainly not going to give me enough. How many do we need? We need for the fish. We are going to want white hibiscus. Did I not plant them? I don't even remember. Or maybe that just came up. Um, doo -doo. we need ten more or eight more okay so I'm going to click on that to go fishing and I got some I need three more so hopefully in the next batch we'll get those done and over here I need to feed the chickens because I want to have eggs on the ground now one of these have been watered and one of these have not um, which is which here that one has an okay this one is 155 and this one is 162 so this one has obviously been watered at least a little bit this one is at 282 and this one's 306 so this one has been watered a little bit so you can see just by watering them one time i've made more money on these flowers just the one time they weren't kept watered the whole time just that one pop in these, remember, can only be harvested every 24 hours. So again, I would say start as soon as you can. Put a few of them in. If you log in once a day for five minutes to do your chores, then you can um, you can harvest these things. And it's not quite, it's 23 hours. So it's not quite every 24. So if you forget one night and you harvest them late after dinner, at least it'll be a little bit earlier the night after. <laughs> So, yeah. So what do we need for, for, for questing? We need white hibiscus. Hmm. All right. Hibiscus are over here. It's going to take an hour and a half. And we needed 40, I think, didn't it? We needed 40. Now, you don't plant these on plowed land. So I'm going to go over here somewhere. We're going to put in the 40 of them. not enough and we'll just put in a little extra and be good so in an hour and a half we can come and harvest these if I want to take the time to water them I will get paid more for them once they are when they come uh, ready for picking and since I'm here already I might as well water them at least the once right and then I always check to make sure I actually counted right because I have been known to make mistakes. So all we need to do is wait on three more tropical fish. That take about a half an hour. And of course, if I wanted to uh, be working on the event that I showed you guys yesterday, I could be planting the trees in here. And then when winter comes along, and remember, you can only get 25. So see, there's only going to be two of these that actually get planted. So there we wore one, just the one. Um, is that right? 19. Why did that only do the one? I wonder why that only did the one. Like, seriously. Where's my trees? Do, do, do. 
there they are here. I have 19. <gasps> because I ran out of money. Oh, that's different. Okay, oops. Okay, that's bad. That's actually really bad. I do not have enough money to buy all of them. I didn't even notice. I'm so used to playing on farms that have got some stuff going on. <laughs> so what can I plant for 968 gold? Not a heck of a lot. This might be a time when, you know, getting that extra 25 gold matters. <laughs> Darn. Okay, well that's pathetic. All right, what can we plant? We gotta plant something. We can make some cash here. Now this won't give us. It's only giving us forty gold per. But I can just plop these. Oh, okay, that's cabbage. I don't want that one anyway. This is giving me fifteen gold each. This is giving me thirty gold each. It's a tad longer. Candy canes. Okay, so candy cane. I wonder if that one of the things that is going to be part of this, or, or that's just some other. I don't know. I don't know. I can't remember. But see, you can own 200 of these, but it seems to me you needed many thousands of them when they came up, too. So, good times. What do I want to plant? I gotta make some money, but I can't afford to plant anything that's very expensive. I only have 900 gold. These are 15 gold each. These are 120 gold each. But I'd be making 30 gold pop. These are 15. You know what? How about here? You know what? We're going to go for these. And we're going to do... We're just going to do it right here in front of this. Because these go quickly. Remember? Because I've got the mod turned on. And see, I couldn't even plant a full 9 there. So. But, you know, I've got, I got a few more this time. Woohoo. I got a, a little bit more money. Ooh. You do all of them this time. And what's happening here is um, it's not I have to actually reselect it every time. If I had enough money to plant another nine, I could just like click on this and harvest and go and then put it up. So now that I've got enough money to go through the process, it's letting me um, it's letting me do that. Before it wouldn't because I it you know, it thought I was trying to harvest and then replant nine more. And it said, you don't have enough money to plant nine more. So I had to reselect it each time. So, and I've done this before. I have run into this situation before where I just don't have enough money to do anything. And normally, you know, without this quick harvest thing, all you'd have been able to do is to plant one crop, wait for 15 minutes and click on it. Well, I didn't even have enough for a full crop. I only had eight, eight plants. I would have had to do that and then wait it out and then come back and do it again. You know, go over and harvest my these for like almost nothing. These are going to give me eight gold each, but you would have had to snag them and get them while you can. Waited for the, you know, the, the trees, the flowers over here to get ready to harvest. You know, it just it can be really, really tedious if you mess that up. And I have done that before. <laughs> Far too often. Oh, God. Oh, I'm so ashamed. But, you know, this way, with, with the mod on, you you know, you can actually do something that doesn't doesn't pay very much, but it doesn't take very long either. And you can, you know, just sit here for watching, uh, I don't know, whatever you watch. Harry Potter. I watch Harry Potter. And uh, make some cash. And I'm full again, but that, that um, there it is. It's, it's ready again. Might as well plant while I'm here. Come and get rid of that. Yeah, I, I love that mod. That one mod is something that I would not want. I, I don't need it or even care about it all that much when you get into a higher level farm. Because there's so many things to do and so much going on. that You, you plant something and just move on to the next thing. Like It's no big deal. Um, I don't worry and this is not wanting to go this time because I won't have enough gasoline to finish it there's the problem with this this time did you notice that it, it wasn't giving me all nine squares it's because I didn't have enough gasoline to plant that many squares and that's full again 
and you'll see here in a second see it's saying oh I didn't even have enough to, to plow that many oh we and I do have if you will notice I'm gonna get this because at this stage in the game I need it if you'll notice I've got two more in, in my currency up there by the the spring the, the little pocket watch that's got the, the shamrock on it I do have two more ribbons now so what I can do is buy another one of these absolutely absolutely freaking lootly do that because it's going to come in full first of all so that's going to help give me a little bit more gasoline snag that again and then just plant a thing now <clears throat> I still don't really have enough money to plant a whole lot of these things that take longer do I well 105 I could I could plant some tomatoes it gives me 60 per harvest okay that's 50 yeah I'm looking for what's that's giving me a hundred now it's gonna take a while but not so much with the mod on how about this one it seems to me oh that's only 90 this one is great now yeah that's 400 gold per pop that's even better but it's twice as long so you know what let's let's plant some grain what the heck we are going to plant some grains uh, except what's the problem here I don't have enough gold to plant that many grains so now we go back to something cheaper <laughs> goodness do what we can yeah but without that mod I wouldn't even be even playing would just be you know just go do something else today because you can't really do anything at all and now will I have enough yep nope not yet getting there Oh, so slowly. And I have to select it again. And now I can replant a second time. Yeah, no, it's fall. Well, I'd hope to do something a little more exciting in the farming department, but it's basically at this point, it's just, you know, if I weren't recording this, I would just be sitting here until um, the fish, the fish is going to allow me to finish off that. They should be, what, about halfway? You know, you might as well be right there. Go right ahead, sweetie pie. And I'm looking at 18 minutes. Okay, eight, I would just sit here doing this for the next 18 minutes, just relaxing, taking it easy, doing some some harvesting, getting rid of some more of these to make more diamonds because we will need them. We will want them. Harvesting this, which is uh, I'm out of gasoline again, as you do grab another 25 gold because right now at this point it all counts <laughs> it matters and I've done this a few times at this level where I just go to plant something and completely forget that I don't have the gold that I would like to have so that one was actually pretty good right let's do let's do one more of these fuel tank is empty all right But that's okay. We can do it this way for a moment. So my next recording, I'm going to give you a couple of housing tours because it's kind of cute, kind of fun. And uh, I do, I'll, I'll be honest, I want to get some recording done on my big fantasy farm um, before I hit the recycle button. I want to have some sort of record of it. I've put a lot of hours in that farm and, you know, it's important to me. I like it. Let's sell this off. Do a bit of watering. Fantasy Farm is actually the name of the first farm I ever owned. I've I've owned two two farms in my life. Um, it was Fantasy Farm and White Pine Stables. And Fantasy Farm was just a few acres of bush, just just bush. And you know it was 
getting electricity in, building a driveway, putting in your own septic system. Um, and no, I did not hire people for this stuff. I learned these things myself. Learning to build, you know, barns and sheds and fencing and, and the rest of it. Yep, I has done these things. And uh, when I went from there, I ended up buying a much bigger place. Okay. Oh, incorrect season. Okay, so that's that. We can't plant any more of these, but they're just coming harvested over here. Are ready to harvest over here. It is crop time. And re remember, replow. Even at home, it's just easier to, to replow. This will give us a nice boost. So we went from what would you know eight nine hundred gold a minute a few minutes ago and now we're up at fourteen thousand thanks to a handy dandy little mod i love it and what you can do of course now keep that in mind too when you're waiting you know go to someone else's farm and do you know help someone else out you come back then you've got a bonus when you're doing your own heart your own harvesting i would be getting a bonus to the money I would be getting a bonus to the crops and I would be getting a bonus to the experience. So not a bad thing to say, I'm going to go help somebody else out for a while. And when I do come back, I will have, you know, I'll get a lot bigger bang for my buck. You can't, I uh, can't complain about that. That is not a bad thing. Do do do. Oh, we're almost there. Is that last one? Yep, there it is. I thought I'm going to have to go down to the other line and come back. But, nope, we're good. I know, we've got 28,000. <clears> and that's mostly filled up. And that's mostly filled up. Now, what I am going to do, because I do want to get as much money as I can, these things are thirsty. So we're going to give these a wee water. And let's go check on the ones we've got over there ready. Actually, let's do this right now. Run, little Christmas sweater person, run. And how are these doing for water? Well, they're down half. Honestly, I don't know if watering them at this point is going to, uh, you know what? It'll keep it filled. And it's not like I have anything else to do at the moment on this particular farm anyway. Do, 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 do. So I've got the bees. I'm waiting. I'm waiting on trees. I'm rhyming. Oh, it's so cute. I'm going to make sure I was watering this side, right? Make sure these stay watered and happy. Now I have eggs, so if a quest comes up and I need eggs, I've got a bit of a, a rush on that. And actually, I think what I'm going to do is add, that's a duck. These are these, right, I believe? The leghorn chickens. I'm going to add a couple of more of these things because there will probably be a quest of some sort that comes up soon. <laughs> Look, he fell it. You see this little guy go sliding down the hill. And I do believe there will be some ducky things in a quest relatively soon. So I'm just going to get ahead of the game a little bit. And yeah, this is a stupid way to put these. But you can. Now, because I've got these together, you'll notice that the chickens and the ducks start wandering back and forth. They will still just be harvested at their own time. And the feed, if I click it here, notice it goes back to the chicken one to actually fill up. Did you notice this was what got bigger? So you can, it, it, there can be some benefit to doing it, to mixing them like this. Because then it allows you to just feed from one spot. That only works with, you know, like animals. You can do that with various horses. You can do that with bunnies. You can do that with cows, pigs, whatever. And, and the, the, the barn fowl, I guess we'll call them. That won't work if you put in, you know, llamas and pigs. That's not going to work. So they have to eat the same kind of food, basically, is what you're looking at. But this has come down to a waiting game. So I'm going to say I'm done for now. Um, 
I'm going to plant some more. Oh, look, I'm making some money on this one. We're going to plant some strawberries. Ooh, ooh, as many as I can with my feeble funds, which turns out to be not a heck of a lot, but, it, you know, it's more than I had a minute ago. And I'll be making some nice cash on these, so that's great. And by watering them, you know, we're going to turn down the time a little bit. And you look down at the strawberry um, symbol there in the, the bottom left-hand corner, you can see that little green line, rip, you know, going around the strawberry icon. That's showing me how much faster this is going than it would have been. Like this is dropping, you know, 20 minutes or so, whatever, every time. So this is going to go much, much faster than it would otherwise. And I could just do this again. Kill some time till those come available. Make a few bucks. And a lot of these have got to be... Oh, I can't do carrots. But see, a lot of these have got to be... Um, words. Like leveled up. You're going to have to level them up. So sitting here doing something like this with some of them is actually not a bad thing. Like at all, at all. That is not a bad idea. Yeah, that's not going to help. I guess I'm done for now, folks. Now, before I leave this farm, I will take whatever amount is there in the gas, in the fuel tanks, because they're not full. There's hardly any. But at least when I come back next time, I, you know, it'll be full and waiting for me, and I'll have that much more in my own personal tractor's gas tank for later. So until I see you guys next time, when we do a little housing tour, live your lives happy, build it beautiful. I hope you're looking forward to the holidays. I realize that a lot of us are going to be alone. I have several friends that are living alone. Um, they're going to be social distancing because they don't actually want to go out there and chance getting their families sick by picking up COVID along the way to travel there. And um, yeah, it's a, we're going to be doing, you know, things like um, using Discord to do some video meals where they're eating, we're eating, where we can at least chat together. And I might be doing a long Christmas stream just to hang out with anybody who want some company that day. Till I see you next time, guys. Bye-bye. And thank you, Patreons.